The insert function dialog box makes using functions in your worksheet easier. The dialog box helps you locate the proper function for the task and provides information about the arguments of the function. If you use the insert function dialog box, you don't have to type functions directly in worksheet cells. Instead, the dialog box guides you through a point and click procedure. You can access this dialog box in several ways. Select the cell where you want to enter the formula. Select formulas tab in the ribbon. In the function library group, click on insert function. Click on the insert function command, which appears at the bottom of each drop down list in the formulas tab in the function library group. Click on the insert function icon, which is directly to the left of the formula bar. Press shift plus F3 keys. The insert function dialog box shows a drop down list of function categories. Select a function category. Functions in that category will display in alphabetical order. Select most recently used. Functions you have inserted recently will be listed in alphabetical order. Select all. All functions will be listed in alphabetical order. If you are not sure which function you need, you can search for the appropriate function by using the search for a function field at the top of the dialog box. Type a brief description of what you want the function to do and click on go. A list of functions likely to fit your needs and based on your description will be listed. When you select a function from the select a function list, Excel displays the function and its arguments and a brief description of what the function does below. Select a function and click on OK or double click on it. Excel will open the function arguments dialog box. The function arguments dialog box will show one text box for each of the function's arguments. We'll show a brief description of the function. As you select the arguments text box, Excel shows a description of the argument. Click on cancel. If the function uses a variable number of arguments such as some function, Excel adds a new box every time you enter an optional argument. Note that required arguments appear in bold while optional arguments are not bold. As you provide arguments, the value of each argument is displayed to the right of each box. You can enter the address manually. Enter E2. You can see the value to the right. As you click on the next text box, Excel adds the next text box. To select the cell or range in the worksheet, click on the collapse button to the right of the text box. The function arguments dialog box collapses. Click on the cell and then click on the expand button to select the cell. Now click on the next text box. To select a range in the worksheet, click on the collapse button. Select the range and click on expand button. You can see the list of cells selected. Click on OK to finish the formula and Excel displays the result in the cell. A few functions such as index have more than one form, meaning it has multiple arguments list. If you choose such a function, Excel displays select arguments dialog box that lets you choose which form you want to use. You need to select one of the argument lists, then click on OK. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel.